My name is Rakesh Kumar and I'm global R&D uh, lead for melon breeding and breeding project lead for melon in North America. Our newest introduction in, uh, in Harper types is Sweet Spring. Uh, it's very nice melon, very nice tight seed cavity, uh, very dark orange flesh, dense netting on the fruit. It's primarily, uh, we have launched it in Arizona for the main season. It's a really good variety, has got a lot of market uh, attraction because of its fruit quality. Sweet Spring has very comprehensive disease resistance package. Uh, it's uh, resistance to three races of physarium, uh, race zero, race one, and race two. It has resistance to three races of powdery mildew, race one, race two, and super race. And it has also resistance to cotton aphid, uh, it's insect resistance. So it's one of the best package in the industry. So in Harper Melon segment, we have second introductions, uh, Sweet Sunrise. Uh, it's Sweet Sunrise primarily uh, target for um, early season in Arizona and uh, uh, California, and also in the fall season. Uh, Sweet Sunrise is bigger in size, that's why it's fit early in the season very well. Uh, it's a very nice fruit, uh, nice round oval shape, tighter net. Internally, it has very dark orange flesh, tighter cavity, uh, very firm flesh, uh, which is really important for shipping. Also, Sweet Sunrise, it has, has cotton aphid resistance. That's why we are also targeting, targeting it for the fall season. In the fall, there's a lot of aphid pressure in the field because a lot of growers plant cotton and a lot of cotton aphid transfer to the, uh, to the melon field. And having cotton aphid resistance is really important. Sweet Sunrise, and most of our varieties has cotton effort resistance.